Hello and welcome to History's a Blast. I'm stopping off on a road trip in Cowan's Gap State Park here in Franklin County, Pennsylvania, this beautiful February the 3rd after a big snowstorm. And I wanted to pause and introduce a short video I made about my home setup for outdoor cooking on charcoal with cast iron. So I hope you enjoy it and stick around to the end because I'm going to conclude with some remarks about four of my favorite uh, uh, YouTube ch uh, outdoor cooking channels. I thought I'd show you my uh, home Dutch oven cast iron cooking outdoor kitchen such as it is. I have a little folding uh, lodge steel uh, charcoal table. I've got a, this is the, a 10 inch uh, lodge Dutch oven that we're cooking in tonight. I'm cooking a recipe uh, from the uh, outdoor cooking with Al YouTube channel. I'll share a link with you. Uh, on that one and uh, it'll be on the screen I guess and uh, it's uh, it's a oh it's a boneless pork ribs tonight Con country style boneless pork ribs with onions and sweet potatoes and I just picked up a uh, really neat little folding uh, uh, charcoal chimney this is a camp made product it folds flat the handle folds down and I got some implements here a lid lifter and uh, a little four by four or four and one trivet tweezers for handling the coals this is a uh, trivet for the, when I want to uh, cook on a skillet to, to give it some standoff and this is a product uh, that I got from another uh, great uh, YouTube charcoal or, or uh, cast iron cooking channel cowboy Kent Rollins and I'll share a link to his YouTube channel here as well larger this is a much larger charcoal chimney which I've been we've been traveling with and it takes up a lot of space in the trailer or in, in it or excuse me in the truck so I'm uh, probably gonna make this a home use only these are available at all the big box uh, home and garden centers any of the hardware big boxes uh, or the uh, big box uh, shopping areas that have home and garden centers you can find these they're relatively inexpensive and they're really great to have you put the newspaper in the bottom and uh, you put your coals on top and you light the newspaper and the newspaper comes up and it starts the coals and the coals just get going and they take off on their own. It's a great little device. I'll come back later when, the, uh, uh, when it's time to check in about uh, 20 more minutes and uh, let's take a look at what's in there. Okay, it's been uh, 30 minutes so it's time to check. Let's see what's going on inside here. This is that uh, country style pork ribs you can't see them in there underneath the sweet taters and onions but nice and steamy the recipe calls for 375 that's uh, theoretically eight coals underneath and 15 on top but I added a coal underneath not so nine underneath and two on tops for 17 I found it's a little chilly it's in the 60s today it's a little chilly not too windy but uh, I find that if I add a, add a coal uh, here and there uh, to start with, and they, of course they, they, they wear down, so they're starting to get uh, weak now. The temperature in there is at 375 by now, but I'm going to put a few more coals on uh, because we've got another 30 minutes uh, to cook. See you back in 30 minutes. Well, it's been 60 minutes total now. And we'll take a look here and see. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, they're doing fine. Yeah, nice bubbling up there. Barbecue sauce. Those onions are nice and caramelized. We'll be taking it off the fire and plating it up here shortly. Well, thanks for hanging in. Uh, there are those four YouTube channels that I want to mention. The first of them is Outdoor Cooking with Al, and these are in no particular order of preference. But Outdoor Cooking with Al, who cooks uh, on uh, charcoal outdoors with uh, all sorts of cast iron implements, specializing in uh, very simple uh, Dutch oven recipes. He's been a real inspiration, as has um, Kent Rollins, Cowboy Kent Rollins, uh, who uh, cooks on uh, actual hard hardwood coals, very traditional, and he's uh, uh, inspired me with a lot of uh, 
recipes uh, that uh, I have or will someday try. Uh, a, th a third uh, cast iron cooking uh, on charcoal, again, is uh, the outdoor gourmet. Sometimes very elaborate recipes, but uh, often very simple recipes for, for camp. And he has a wonderful outdoor kitchen that might inspire those of you who have better means than I do. And fourthly, on a very historical standpoint, is Townsend's YouTube channel. Townsend's and Son are a supplier of uh, uh, reproduction clothing, uh, equipment, and cooking cooking utensils and recipe books from 18th century frontier America. Uh, and they, they work with uh, the living history community a lot. And I've been inspired by a lot of uh, the Townsend uh, videos as well. So I'll put links to all four of those in the description below. And again, if you like this video, and I hope you did, give us a thumbs up and uh, come back for more. Thanks for watching. Please click the thumbs up icon to like the video and share with your friends via email or social media. I'd love to have you subscribe, and if you do, please click the little bell icon so you'll get notifications whenever I post a new video. Goodbye!